Oh my goodness. The Easter Bunny came. Happy Easter. Evie. I don't even think you realize. Are you going to help us search for some eggs? Look at this big boy in this very cool bouncer. He's loving it. He is. We put on Easter Parade. Classic. For, for some classic background noise while we enjoy our Easter morning. Look at him in these ears. <laughs> He's got a big enough noggin that fills it out. This thing is so fancy. It bounces, it spins, it's got all these noise makers. And a cool like mood light over there and counter, like bounce counter. Gosh. You love it, Jamesy boy? Wow. He's gotta figure out how to spin. Yeah, the whole thing spins. I'm like trying to not, but his he needs to be just a little taller. We can put like a book or something underneath. The way you say, oh look at him, look at him stretching. Come on, spin. Spin. He loves this fox. There you go. He's like, wait, I want to look at this bee. <laughs> Get that fox. Evie girl got a new toy. Such a cute little plant. And some wet food. And these fancy little treats. All oh, the jelly beans and chocolates and the basket. James boy got some new babes. And this cute little lamby plush. And this fancy like teaser thing? So cute. Should we find some eggs? Oh, I think I see one above you. Oh, God. Let's see if Jamesy will grab it. Get it! Get the egg! Get the egg! Grab it. Almost. <laughs> what? Wow. This is Easter, James. <laughs> I, want, oh. I want a fresh omelet. Try to hide three eggs with treat to them for Eve, but Eve is also the worst hunting dog ever. Like a squirrel could just like walk right in front of her and sit, and she wouldn't even realize. Can't get that one open. So we're gonna see how this goes. Let the hunt begin. Okay, sniff it out. Sniff it out. Yay! <laughs> Ready? Sit. Good girl. Alright, let's go find more. Okay. Over that way. Come on, sniff it out. Okay, you learned that an egg has a treat in it. Here, I'll help it. It's on this side of the Maybe the next time. <laughs> How about when you wake up Easter morning and your baby is just a big baby who just chills in your lap now? This is a hit. 
I think it's because he can play with it. While drooling mm -hmm. on it, while chewing on it. Yeah. You're having a great Easter morning. Oh, yes. The feet for the assist. <laughs> Sounds like that would be your child. <laughs> All right, we're gonna make some blueberry muffins. Jamesy boy, yeah. He's gonna help dad bake these muffins. Jamesy boy, yeah, yeah. We got some Valentine's Day things. We're not Valentine's Day. Oh, Easter. Oh gosh, she's loving this mushroom. We're getting there. We're using, we're not using eggs, we're using, um, I forgot the fancy word for it, but we're using garbanzo beans um, juice as an egg replacement um, for the plant-based people in the world. Um, but it's simple mix. They got us a can of blueberries that came with it, mixing it up. Got our cup holders, liners, whatever those things are called. Preheated oven, we're looking ready to go. Are you ready? Thanks for being such a good helper. Thank you. Looks pretty good. We're gonna get it all panned out and toss it in. All right, we got the muffins are rising. And we have brownie batter going over here. And a, a fresh Sarah. And a baby who's about to get a bath too. Thanks for the help, Jamesy boy. He was doing so good. We have to grandma's house. Yeah. She did. They got <gasps> the kids got worms for hot We got worms. We got worms. <laughs> we got a little crunch and they won't quit. <laughs> Be, look. Ow. Ah. Guess what caterpillars Good. turn into? A butterfly. So guess what these guys are gonna turn into? A butterfly. Yeah. 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 What's this? Butterfly. Yeah. You see that butterfly there? Mm -hmm. I can see it. Can I see it? Look. Whoa. They're almost there. They're gonna climb up, up, up. Yeah. You see the work turns like that? So we got the first row of stuffed shells down. We have sauce on the bottom, and then in each shell, there's a mixture of ragot cheese, parsley, egg. Mom, what other kind of cheese is in here? Mozzarella? Romano and mozzarella. Um, so that's what they're stuffed with. And then I'm gonna put um, a layer of mozzarella. No, I'm sorry, a layer of sauce, layer of mozzarella, and then a whole nother layer of noodles. And then another layer of sauce, another layer of cheese.
Oh, friends, I have not been this full. I don't even know since when. Probably since our Disney staycation in July, June, July. I feel you, James. We are filled to the brim. We're quickly stopping by um, Peter's brother's house um, to see the family, but also to ask Peter's brother to be James's godfather, so that's exciting. Um, and then we're gonna go back to my mom's for dessert and head home. We're all just like in, a, in like food stupors, so we'll see how late the night ends up being. April 4th, the man who removes a mountain begins by carrying away small stones. Chinese proverb. We are zonked. We're zonked. We're tired. We're bamboozled. We're full. We're eating a lot of jelly beans right now. <laughs> Gotta eat all the jelly beans tonight. Oh gosh. Guys. We have been talking about it. We just, I mean, I feel like we always like watch something and get inspired, but like. No, we've been talking about it. I've been feeling yeah, it for a long yeah. time. So we just feel like, I mean, obviously we ate a ton today, but since we've moved here, we've been eating a lot of food from restaurants. Um, really, we've just been eating out more than ever. And I think it's warranted us being excited and being back and whatnot, but like. It's kicked our butt. We're gonna make some changes and we're gonna feel better. Gonna get back into running. I'm gonna get up earlier. I'm just gonna feel better. We're going back plant based. I just posted on Facebook. I calculated it's 97. We're going to be 95% plant based. Really? And that's 20 out of 21 meals out of the week. Meaning, so like you guys, we've talked about this before. Sarah's better with like self control than I am, and I have to go all in or nothing or I have to have like very defined things so what it is for Peter that I'm assuming Sarah probably just will fall but she doesn't have to is I'm gonna eat plant-based every single meal snacks all the time like right now like we we have butter like we have like little bits of sour cream when we're at Christina like but like it, we were saying we're gonna eat it whenever we want to eat not plant-based when we go out but like that just turned into like whenever we're at Sarah's mom's or her sisters or our friends right. or families or whenever we go out, yeah. it wasn't just we oh we go. might eat plant based. It was like no, we're going to not eat plant based. So yeah. for what it is, it's I'm going back to plant based, with the exception of Friday night pizza. Yeah, and I might have a might couple change. more exceptions, but it'll probably be. But like Sarah, also, can, Sarah can handle those exceptions, and I do think I can't. that overall we'll be eating at home more. Yeah. Because, like, our honeymoon phase of, like, being back, yeah. eating all of our, you know, that kind of has to... I got running details yeah. I want to talk about and fundraising details, but we're going to say that for tomorrow's vlog. Yeah. Um, Peter's off of work tomorrow. I'm taking tomorrow off. I'm saying fooey to them. I literally didn't give a single reason why at, like, noon on Friday. I was like, you know what? I'm fed up. <laughs> And I just sent the notice to my team and my, my director, my VP, and it just said, Peter PTO, Monday. Yeah. Nobody, nobody asked questions. And my answer was going to be, if they asked me what, why I needed the time off, my answer was going to be, because it's my time off. Yeah. <laughs> we are also going to a Cubs game tomorrow night. Tomorrow night. But I'm we'll so have all excited. time. We'll have the whole day. Yeah. Um, yeah. And um, James's last little, little Easter. I didn't even... We didn't really even show his Easter outfit. Maybe I'll put in a couple of photos here. Um, but it was a, it was a, a long day, but it was a really good day. Yeah. Yeah. It's good to be home. It's good to be home. We know what our goals are, we know what we hope to accomplish, and believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions.